Hey everyone, it's Daniel, and today we're going to be looking at how to make instrumentals and acapellas using this program called UVR. And it's really easy, you don't have to download anything, it doesn't cost anything, and it really only takes a few minutes. So first, if you click the link in the description, you should be able to open this page. As you can see here, there's a lot of options. And first we're going to start with the option on how to make an instrumental first. So the settings that you're going to want to choose, we're going to want to uncheck Mount Drive. We're not going to be doing that. And then after you do that, just click this play button. It's okay, run anyway. And it should take a couple minutes, but then after that, then you should be good. So as you can see here, it says downloading models. That just means that the program is being downloaded, so then you can run it later. All right, so about three minutes and 10 seconds later, it's finally done downloading. And we got a fast GPU, so that means that the next step should be a little bit faster, so it might be a little bit slower for when you try it. So, ignore this for now. Here we go, input files, enter any link or file name. We're going to be using a YouTube link for Imagine Dragon's song Bones. So we just have to click on the lyric video, click on the link, let's copy it, paste it here. And so the next step we're going to do is we're going to choose the pre-trained model. So if you're going to want to make an instrumental, the pre-trained model you're going to want to use is 4-band 3090-Arch-500-M1, whatever that means. That's the instrumental one. So once we choose that, we're going to change some of the other settings as well. The window size, we're going to go down to around 320. And the rest of it, you should probably stay the same. Aggressiveness is 0.3. GPU, you're going to want to turn it on to make it even faster. You're going to want to turn on deep extraction. This makes it a little bit higher quality of an instrumental. We're going to leave this off. We're going to leave this off. And then we're going to turn on download because when it's done, then it's going to download the files for us. So once we're done with that, we're going to click on this play button right up here. And I'll see you on the other side. All right, that's been about three minutes, and it just downloaded this .zip file, which has both the instrumental and an acapella that they want us to download, but is not as good as this other acapella we're about to get. So before we open this instrumental, we're going to go up here, and we're going to create the acapella file. So we're going to change around some settings. This pre-trained model, we're actually going to be using a different thing. Scroll down here, and we're going to be using MGM V5 Vocal 2 Band which is going to be for the acapella. We're also going to change around some settings here. We're going to want to change the aggressiveness down to 0.1. It sounds a lot better if it's not as aggressive. We're also going to be removing deep extraction. And we're going to be turning on ice vocal, because this is a vocal output after all. We're also going to be turning on test time augmentation, because that makes it sound a little bit better and keep everything else the same. And we just hit the play button again, and then we create our, our acapella. All right, so we finished downloading the vocals. This one only took about half the time as it does to download the instrumental. This is just because it processes vocals a lot better than it does the instrumental. So anyways, now that we finished downloading it, we should open it. As you can see, we have two new .zip files, one that contains the instrumental and one that contains the vocals. So we know that the one that downloaded first has the instrumental, so we'll open that up first. So there should be two mp3 files. The one, let's see what this one is. I think the top one is the instrumental and the bottom one is the is the acapella. So we're going to be moving this into our downloads folder. So this is the instrumental for Bones now. And then we'll go to the second folder, the one that has our acapella in it, because it downloaded second. And we're going to be taking out the second one, because the second file is the vocals. So, here we go. Alright, and now we have our instrumental. Let's hear it. Sounds clean, not 100% perfect, but it sounds pretty clean. Now let's open up our acapella. Magic, 
yeah, sounds good. And there we go. We just made an acapella and an instrumental in about five minutes. Hope you can use this too. Once again, the program is called UVR. And if you have any error at all, just post it in the comments and it'll help you out. Special shout out to the people who made it. And if you like this content, make sure to like the video. Thank you.